Three years ago, Delilah was laying her plans. The Duke's people gathered at the home of a mine baron named Aramis Stilton to commit some horror in her name. I need to know how they made her immortal. But where was I three years ago? Letting Emily daydream through council meetings, teaching her fencing and back alley fighting. I always expected an enemy we could put down with a sword. Soldiers, spies, assassins. Instead, we got something else. Beyond the pale. Beyond the natural world. Instead, we got hit by someone like me. is out in the city, but I'll explain. I need to know why Delilah can't be killed. Everything we've learned implies that something strange happened at Aramis Stilton's home three years ago, but then he disappeared. Stilton lived in a bunker kept secure by a fancy lock made by Jindosh. Maybe inside you'll learn more about how to stop Delilah. But I have to get there first, through a ruin created by the Duke, where I used to live. Megan had an intriguing idea. Paolo is leader of the Howlers. He wants Vice Overseer Byrne killed. And of course, Byrne wants Paolo dead too. Both groups will attack you on sight, but walk in with the corpse of their chief enemy, and they'll treat you like family. So that gives me at least one way into Aramis Stilton's house. I'm pretty sure that will work. Coming back here, seeing it changed, run into the ground some people have reached beyond others the old batista neighborhoods full of mining families called the dust district now no more witches in karnaka
I knew plenty of people like Paolo growing up. Maybe not as crafty. Vice Overseer Burn. I dread each interaction with the Abbey. If I put people to work down in a mine, I'd want to live in a fortified bunker too. is headed into the dust district. Corvo says he hasn't been back in a long time. I can't blame him for that. According to Sokolov, he'll be trying to get into Aramis Stilton's house. <laughs> Not easy. I've tried. Stilton was a friend. Even as a mine owner, he was a good man who came up from working people and never forgot it. I went looking for him the night he disappeared. The house was swarming with the Grand Guard. I showed them what I was worth, but it cost me. I'll live to see that score settled. I never suspected. Ready now? Let's go. You take Megan's skiff closer. 